Hello and welcome to Coffee Break. My name is Michael Murat, reading today from 2 Timothy chapter 4, beginning in verse 1. I charge thee, this is a command from God to preachers. I command thee, or I charge thee, therefore, before God and the Lord Jesus Christ, who shall judge the living and the dead at his appearing and his kingdom. Preach the word, be diligent in season, out of season, reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine, for the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine, but after their own lust shall they heap to themselves teachers having itching ears. Evangelical theology is beyond weak at this point. It is, in essence, hollow. It is as flavorless as water because there's no substance to it. If your goal is to never offend anyone, and that is the goal of much of modern evangelicalism, then you can't say anything worth hearing, and you certainly will not teach the Word of God as it is written, because Jesus himself said that the Word of God will offend and divide those who love it from those who hate it, the righteous from the unrighteous, the children of the devil from the children of God. Consequently, in their insipid attempt to be a friend to everyone, including, no, actually, especially those who have little or no regard for Christ, they offend Jesus, and yes, they make themselves his enemies. In their empty-headed attempt to be accepted by all, especially the lukewarm and the unsaved, they water down truth to the point where now 50% of evangelicals think that Muslims and Jews are accepted by God. And 33% of modern evangelicals don't believe that Jesus is God. Shame on the pastors and the teachers for willfully excluding truth and withholding truth from the people that they are commanded by God to teach in season, out of season, reprove, rebuke, exhort with all sound doctrine. This has been Michael Moret with another coffee break.